We welcome you back to Bellingham, Washington, as your SFU women's basketball team takes on Grand Canyon Antelopes in the West Region semifinals. The girls get off to a quick start as senior Carla Wyman finds a lane and gets the bucket to fall two of her four on the night. Carla again with the ball, but this time she doesn't find any room and gives it to Collins who drains the deep three ball to put the clan on top early. Christina would finish with a game high 19, the fans showing their support as they made the trip across the border. Christina dishes it to Nayo and the GNAC player of the year drives hard down low for the bucket, two of her 15 and she had another double double. Nayo again, but this time she finishes off the tic-tac-toe with the easy jumper as the clan go up by 23 with 10 to play. Marilyn Petit feeds it to Kia Van Lair, and the local kid from New West takes it herself and gets the off-balance lay-in to fall. We can't forget about Chambers, finishing with 11 on the night as she gets the basket and the foul, leading to the clan's convincing victory of 76-59 to over Grand Canyon. The women played one of their best games of the season, shooting 57% from the floor and an impressive 53 from downtown. They now play the West Region Finals against the winner of Western Washington and Cal State Monterey Bay tomorrow night. I was able to catch up with Coach Langford to get his thoughts on the stellar performance as well as Christina Collins on what a game she had. Well, I thought we needed to uh, try to contain their two big scorers. Um, Judy Jones is obviously a great driver. Um, we tried to clog up the lane a little bit, and there were some problems in there. Thought so hopefully maybe we could get her to turn the ball over a little bit. Uh, we really didn't want Maylene to be able to go off of the three, um, so we contested her pretty hard up there, I thought, and, and we didn't let her go off of the three, and I was pleased with our defensive intensity the whole game. Uh, we tried to do a better job on the boards, because despite how good we were, I thought defensively we really didn't take care of the boards. Um, as well as we needed to. They are, they have several very good rebounders, um, so we tried to shore that piece up and we just tried to reinforce that we thought that what we were doing with uh, both of their good players to continue to do it. We got a lot of support in the lane on screen and rolls especially, and I thought it caused some turnovers and some deflections that helped us. Uh, I thought we had really good preparation, both mentally and physically taking care of our bodies on that day off, um, to come out and play hard. I think that uh, a lot of Canadians are proud of those Americans that go south and play, and they're also very proud of the league that they have. And um, I think that for many, it would be nice if they could see that we're a very competitive, good option for them in their choices of what they have to do with the university careers. And we provide a wonderful educational institution as well as a um, very competitive basketball environment that allows kids to reach their potential. We'd like them to see that. Just to be mentally prepared. Um know the team that we're going to play and um, just be prepared on our end. We know what we can do. We know what we're capable of um, and do those things. Well, we, we've, um, you know, we obviously know Western quite well. We've played them several times and I've been harping to them nonstop that the only game that's going to matter with Western to these girls is the last time we play them. Um, and tomorrow will be the last time to play them if that's who we get. Um, we try to focus hard on learning them, knowing them inside out, and I thought that uh, we did a very good job of that in our place, a very poor job of that in our uh, game a week ago, and so we'd like to show that we're um, ready. If it's Monterey Bay, they're a team we played last year, they're a little bit different, um, so we don't know them as well, um, but whoever wins this game is obviously going to be a very good team and ready to compete, and we need to just sit back and relax and enjoy ourselves because you got to play the game that I like to play, which is the first one. You get to see who you get in the next one.